All right, what's going on everyone? It's Sean with another Tesla video, and in this one we're gonna look at how efficient Tesla's arachnid wheels are. These wheels are from Tesla's referral program. Actually, in fact, they, they do offer the arachnid wheels if you do the uh, Model S P100D in the, the black version. But uh, for these, these came from the uh, referral program, and uh, these are the 26535 on 21 inch wheels, and then the front wheels are 24535 on 21s. So they're staggered. The ones in the back are bigger. They're supposed to be lighter and stronger than the turbine wheels that Tesla also offers. So we're going to look at the data and see just exactly how efficient they are. And I'm going to spread this out over probably two or three videos. We'll take a look at the arachnid wheels in this one. And then in the next video, I'm going to put on my 19-inch uh, slipstream wheels. And I'll talk about the efficiency of those, compare the two, and see which ones are actually more efficient. Are the 19-inch slipstream wheels and tires more efficient? Or, because these are lighter, are these more efficient? We're gonna find out in a second video in this series. But let's just kind of take a look at these and see how they've worn over time first. Okay, so these have actually worn surprisingly well. Now, the nice thing about the staggered wheels is that uh, it's not really necessary to have the tires rotated. So, so these tires have been in the same place since I put them on uh, earlier this year. Now, I've put about 18,000 miles on these uh, tires and wheels over the last, uh, let's say, uh, six to eight months. And um, thankfully, there's no curb rash around the edges. Um, there's no nicks around here uh, since they haven't been changed and the tires the tire tread the tire treads getting low so at some point here pretty soon um, what is that oh, that's a rock so at some point here pretty soon I'll probably want to um, put some new rubbers on them the only nick that I have in these is on the front left wheel and I'm guessing that's because a rock jumped up and, and hit it all the way around, the tires and wheels look really, really good. Let's take a look at these here. These as well look really, really great. In fact, I, I see some dirt on them I need to come and wipe off. And uh, these as well look, actually, did I forget to clean these? I think I did, actually. We'll come back and clean these, but no nicks. Uh, there might be a small one right there, but overall, they've worn extremely well. So if you can see here, the bottom one is the number of miles that I've traveled since I put them on in, I think it was May, I put the uh, 21 inch uh, arachnids on. I drove them for maybe about 1200 miles back in December when I first had them delivered from Tesla. I've used 4,552 kilowatt hours with an efficiency of 280 watt hours per mile. That's driving all around Denver, to some hills, some mountains, uh, but uh, I would say most of the driving has been in town. Most of these miles have been on a 60 kilowatt hour battery, and then about a month ago, I had the battery replaced, and now I'm running on a 75 kilowatt hour battery pack. So. Overall, I'm actually really, really impressed. I guess the other thing to bear in mind is that the temperatures have been in the 80s and 90 degrees. But I think still, even with the air conditioner running and going up hills and down hills, that's a pretty good efficiency, 280 watt hours per mile. So in the next video, I'll talk about the, the 19 inch slipstream wheels with winter tire tread on them. I did some testing before I took the winter tires off last winter and put these current ones on. So we'll compare the two and see which ones are actually more efficient. I'd love to see in the comments down below. Do you think the smaller, slimmer 19 inch tires and wheels are more efficient? Or do you think because these are forged aluminum, do you think that these current 21 inch arachnid wheels are more efficient. Put it in the comments down below and we'll find out for certain in the next video. Thanks so much for watching and if you found this video valuable please consider hitting subscribe and like. See you on the next one.